Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to this channel. Uh, it has been a while since my last video. Uh, I have been very busy with a lot of stuff, family, works, etc. Right? Uh, of course, uh, highly young stuff. So I hope everybody is doing great. Uh, today, I just want to drop this video very quickly and uh, share something uh, with you. Uh, about Hylian. Um so uh, hopefully it will sh shed some lights uh, about the Hylian progress. For people who have been following uh, Hylian for a while, um, we all know um, what stage Hylian is in right now. Um, for the past year and a year and a half, uh, Hylian has been um, intensively uh, testing um, its flagship uh, uh, truck, uh, ERX. So now Highland has entered uh, this uh, critical moment just before the commercialization, right? Which is the uh, certification uh, process, right? So during the last earning call, uh, uh, we know that uh, Hylian uh, uh, is aiming uh, to get uh, three certification. One is uh, from California, one is the, it's called EPA, which is a federal level, and uh, another one NHTSA, so that one we already got it, right? So uh, we have two more left to, to get it, and, and Hylian claims we're going to get during this quarter. Uh, in, in Q3 2023. Can Hylian get it in this quarter? Um, we shall see, right? So, but in this video, um, uh, I'm gonna just quickly show you uh, something very interesting about the, the certification, um, specifically about the CARB one. Uh, for the EPA, I have, I have not found anything uh, useful but uh, yeah, so let's uh, let's take a look. If you uh, type uh, "new vehicle and engine certification" uh, in Google and uh, do a quick search, uh, uh, the top result is from the CARB. Right? Uh, you can just click uh, either one of this. Uh, it will lead you to the certification program. And so basically, this program is uh, responsible for all the certification of all the new engine vehicles and the powertrains uh, in California. So without this, nobody can sell any uh, new uh, vehicle or engine in California, right? So this is the most uh, important one, one, one of the most important one. Okay, so now you see there are different categories. There's a light duty. Uh, of course, there will be a heavy duty. So we, uh, what we are looking at is the, the second one. So click the executive orders and uh, it will lead you to more uh, categories. So medium duty and heavy duty is what we are looking for. So click the EO summary, right? So as soon as you click this, it will pop up uh, a download uh, uh, a download progress bar. It will download uh, ex express sheet for you, uh, which I already uh, downloaded here for you guys, right? So just open it up. So in this spreadsheet, there are about uh, let's see, totally like a four thousand, almost four hundred, four thousand two hundred um, list. So almost uh, 4,200 uh, vehicles or new uh, engines that either is already past the certification, which is like uh, active, or is waiting uh, to be certified, right? So like uh, some of uh, like this, uh, it doesn't have any details, uh, which means it's, it's, it's pending, okay? It's pending. So let's just do a quick search. Uh, control F and uh, enter the keyword Hylian in this uh, search box. 
uh, that's where we are most uh, interested in, right? So, and uh, click find. And voila. So there's only one result uh, for this search. So the item 3813, it's, uh, it's about Hylian. Okay, uh, let's uh, zoom in a little bit uh, to make it uh, more uh, visible. Okay, so, okay, so, um, uh, so right off the bat, the uh, uh, EO number, so A517, I think that's the, the code for uh, Hylia, uh company, and uh, 0001, that's uh, uh, for the, like, uh, I think the index for the truck, right? So there's the first uh, truck, so that's why it's the number one. Um, that's just uh, my uh, uh, my uh, guess based on what I learned about the, the rest of the, the numbers. So I think this this is just the code for the uh, for the company. And uh, also you can see the status is active, right? So it's uh, I think it's still pending. And that's why the the date there's no date, right? So there's no signed date, no revised date, right? So it's pending. And uh, for the year, it's 2023. So that's for the year X, right? So the, for this year, so that's the, uh, the latest year. And uh, for the manufacturer, you can see they put both comments and the Hylian name in there. So we all know that uh, in comments, it's gonna help Hylian to do the certification, right? Um, so that's why they put uh, both name, which uh, which makes sense, right? And uh, the engine family um, is something we're going to talk about next. But before that, uh, well, let's do some filter um, because there are so many records. Uh, most of the records we don't even care. All we care about is the Hylian ones, right? So for the year, uh, we only select the twenty twenty three. Okay, that reduced to about 70 records. And the next we're gonna filter based on the uh, engine family, right? Uh, I think that's the, uh, like one of the important uh, information. So the engine f uh, family we're looking for is um, P27, so this one, PCE XH, 729 XDA. Okay, so now we only have four records, right? <clears throat> they both uh, from 2000, 2023 and the uh, engine family the same, right? So what are this engine family? So let's go to the right, right? So you can see the fuel type is a natural gas. So my guess will be the engine family, this is all natural gas engine, uh, 12 liter natural gas engine. Because we know Hailiang is using Cummins uh, uh, natural gas, 12 liter natural gas engine. So uh, that's why they put it in the same um, uh, category, uh, which also makes sense, right? <coughs> All right, so uh, let's see, there are two there are four uh, items here, but the two of which is already um, have some records in there. So one is uh, from last year, September 20th. That's one, that one is superseded, right? And uh, the next one, the next one is uh, from this year, March 14th. So that one is uh, still active. So it looks like for this two natural gas, uh, for these two records, um, the the company just renewed the certification, uh, looks like, right? So one, this one is uh, superseded, and uh, the next one they renewed it in March. So you can see from the, you can even see from the from the number, right? So this is the uh, the first the first one, and the next one is the uh, dash one, right? So which means this superseded this one, right? And uh, so. So how long will it take the Hylian one to get the certified, certif uh, certified right? So uh, based on this date, looks like a half year. From uh, September 
last year to March, that's, that's look like uh, six months ish, right? So maybe uh, the next one for Hailian, so six months uh, after March, that will be uh, like uh, this month or next month. So it could be very soon. Um, that's just my <laughs> my guess, right? So uh, hopefully we can get the, the certification uh, before um, a next earning call, right? So that will uh, be very uh, exciting. Uh, from a re recent uh, example, uh, this uh, EV company called uh, XOS. So they just got some, um, I guess, uh, incentive uh, improvement from uh, CARB. And uh, the stock just jumped uh, about uh, uh, 30% uh, pre-market, right? Uh, on that day, uh, on the day they uh, released the news. So, um, yeah, so uh, as an investor, uh, we could uh, we could uh, expect the same uh, results if uh, they uh, highly announce uh, the certification uh, uh, proven, right? So, yeah, so that will be very uh, interesting to see it for the next month or so. Um, uh, so, of course, that's the great milestone uh, for highly as well, right? So, um, they have the certificate to uh, to move to uh, uh, commercialization stage, right? So that's a big, very big uh, milestone for Hylian as well. Okay, so uh, that's all I want to share today. Uh, ho hopefully uh, you are like uh, excited as, uh, as I am, uh, because um, if, uh, if uh, Commons can uh, get uh, 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 the certification for its, uh, uh, natural gas engine, I don't see why a CARB won't uh, certify a highly on a, a truck, right? So, uh, so finger crossed. Um, um, yeah, so good luck uh, everyone and thank you for watching and see you uh, next video.